episode three, Anansi and the Melon. Anansi the spider sat in a tall tree watching goat work in his garden. Goat's melons look delicious, thought Anansi. <clears throat> the spider looked fleet, but he was too lazy to grow anything himself. When goat left, Anansi dropped into the garden. With a thorn, he carved a hole in the melon. He began to crawl inside and, and, to, and, and began to eat and eat and eat. And as he rubbed his full belly, Go will be back soon, he said. I must go. He tried to crawl up through the hole, but now he was too fat. I'll wait up until I'm thin again. Anansi grew bored while he waited. When Goat returned, Anansi got an idea. He loved to play tricks. He could trick Goat. When Goat picked up the melon. Ow! Anansi yelped. Who said that? Goat cried, looking around. Me, replied the melon. Goat blinked. Melons can't talk. Yes, we can. This is incredible, said Goat. Emma showed the queen. He hurried toward the palace. Brown snake saw him. Where are you going? She called. I'm taking this melon to the queen, replied Goat. It hot. That's silly, laughed Snake laughed. As silly as... Kind rattlesnake, said the melon. Rattlesnake scowled. Ah, who said that? I told you the smelling talks, said Goat. Amazing, said Rattlesnake. I'll go with you. And Goat and Rattlesnake heard ahead toward the palace. More animals heard the melon talking. They followed Goat and Rattlesnake to the palace. Go bowed. Your Majesty, we brought you a melon. The Queen frowned. I already have plenty of melons. This melon is in Yuko, explained the goat uh, proudly. It can talk. The Queen stood up closer. Speak, melon, she ordered. But the melon stayed quiet. Melon, I order you to speak. Still, the melon was silent. What a silly melon, the queen snapped. Silly, echoed the melon. You're the one who was talking to a melon? The queen's face turned right red. She picked up the melon and fell with all her might. A melon hit a tree and goes skirt and shattered into pieces. A Nazi crowd out of the melon. I'm thin again, he said happily. I'm hungry too. He scurried up a nearby banana tree. And go return to his garden. Dumb melons, I'm never going to listen to you, to you again. Good idea, called a banana. Talking melons always bring trouble. Huh.